So for today's video, we're going to talk about greater than or more than, less than, and equal to. And I'm going to use Pac-Man to show how this works. So the more or greater than and less than symbols can be used to compare numbers and objects. The greater than symbol is this one here. The less than symbol is this one here. And the equal to symbol is this one here. Now, I plan to use Pac-Man to demonstrate how these symbols are applied and how they work using the numbers or pictures or something, anything that you're using here, okay? So we're gonna use the less than, greater than, or equals to symbol to show which one is bigger or which one has more or the greater amount. So you've got five cones on this side and three cones on the other side here. So which one has more? Right, it's going to be the five, okay? Now this is where I use Pac-Man here because what I was told is you can see the symbol of Bummy looks like this. Well, the Pac-Man also looks very similar in that symbol. And the way I was told is that Pac-Man always wants to eat more or the greater amount that he has to choose from. So he's always gonna go in that direction here, okay? So what you can say is that five is greater than three here. Looking at this dice here, we can see that there's two here and six here, okay? So which one has more? Which one has the greater amount? Or in this case, which one has less, okay? So we know that this is the direction that the symbol is going in because there's six here. And then we also know that Pac-Man is also gonna be going in that direction because there's more here to eat on this side. So what you can say here is that two is less than six here. So looking at the butterflies here and the ladybugs, which one has more, which one has the greater amount or which one has the less amount? Well, yeah, you can see they're both equal here. Okay, now I was lucky enough to find a Pac-Man symbol here that's showing that he's basically gonna eat both because they're the same amount here. Okay, so I just wanted to share that with you that the equals means that they're both the same amount. There's four butterflies, there's four ladybugs, hence neither one is greater than or less than. Okay, so now we're just gonna look at numbers here. And as you can see, we've got one and six. So again, which one is the less or greater than amount? Where would the symbol go here? Which in which direction? That's right, it's gonna go towards the six. And again, as six is bigger than one, Pac-Man is going to go in that direction here. So the way you can say this is that one is less than six. Looking here, we got five and five. So again, as we know, they're both equal. And that means that the symbol for Pac-Man is gonna eat both of them because they're both the same size here. Five is not, five and five are not greater than or less than to each other, they're equal. Five is the same on this side as well as this side. So now we have eight and zero here. So which direction is the symbol going to go? Yes, it's gonna to go towards the eight because eight is bigger than zero. And we know that Pac-Man as well will wanna eat the bigger amount, the greater amount, the one that has more, so he's gonna to go towards the eight. So for the bonus activity, I just want you to do the same thing as identify with greater than, less than, or equal to symbols, these different symbols here, these different pictures, these different shapes, whatever you wanna call them here, okay? And just draw which way the symbol will go here for these three. And I got another bonus activity here, just using numbers here, and we're doing the same thing. Just going to draw the symbol showing which way it would go facing the bigger number here. So that's today's video and again I just wanted to introduce to you what greater than, less than, and equal to look like using not just the traditional symbol but as you can see here the Pac-Man symbol because the mouth of Pac-Man looks really close to the symbol here. Now you don't have to use Pac-Man Okay, I've seen alligators and crocodiles, you know, I've seen, you know, just different things to help you remember which way the symbol goes. And that's the whole point of all this, okay? So if you think that this 
uh, game might be a bit dated. That's cool. I'm not here to like, you know, get you to get uh, in, into Pac-Man or anything, but I just wanted to show you something that will help you remember which way the symbol goes when you're doing greater than, less than, especially, okay? So that'll do it for today's video. And as always, thank you so much for spending part of your day here with me. And I look forward to seeing you for my next video.